bother with you. Get some fresh air. That's better. Look at here. He doesn't look very tough to me. Does he look tough to yeah. you? Huh? I don't look too tough. Don't mark his face. Oh, no, no. We're not going to hurt his face, are we? <laughs> All right. Go. Go. My sir. <laughs> I think he's drunk. Stand on your feet. You're a tough man. Hey, sweet man. I'm sorry, man. We got you two are attached together. Let's see if we can get a little air between you. There, you step away here. That's better, isn't it? Let's see this movie. You don't look too tough now. You wouldn't get in all this smoke trouble. What's the matter with you? You're drunk. Oh, he looks like a sniper to me. get that wee shit. There it is, Jack. That's a little scene from the movie Sweet, Sweetback's Badass Song with uh, Melvin Van Peebles. So you hard-headed so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans finally got a chance to see a real live hero. This is what you've been looking for, right? Because you damn sure didn't get it in the movie Black Panther. They killed off the real hero. Anyway, let's go to the book of Romans 11 and verse 7. It says, What then? Israel have not obtained that which he's seeking for. And what is Israel seeking for? For fairness, for peace, opportunity, salvation, ultimately. But we haven't obtained that here, okay? We're in hell here. It's a psychological warfare that's going on against our people by this devil, by this so-called white man. This man is tricking us. He's, buff he's making a buffoon out of us. He's using us, okay? It says, but the election have obtained it, and the rest were blinded. So most of you hard-headed so-called Negroes in America and throughout this world, you're going to be blinded. You don't know what's going on. You don't know what a damn hero is. You don't know what peace and uh, fairness and opportunity and salvation really is. You, you, do you niggas even want that? You want to be integrated with this white man. You want to be equal to him. You're not. According to the Bible, you're better than him. You're above. There's not going to be two kings. There's only going to be one king. So either you're going to want to rule and be a, ro a royalty, or you're going to want to be underneath this white boy. You got to be able to choose what you want. I know what I want. And the election know what they want. So um, with that, hey, man, you got a chance to see a real live hero putting this white boy to debt. That's what it's all about. Coming up against him. Strap up. The time is at hand. So with that, I say peace.
to the elders, the apostles, the great men, the men of Great Millstone, and peace and safety to those other brothers out there. I'd like to thank Yahweh, who's the Most High, and his son, who the world called Jesus Christ, who we know in ancient Hebrew as Yahweh Shai. We're almost out of here. It's going to be a fight to the finish, and we're going to win. With that, I say Shalom.